So a new iPhone came out, everybody's getting cell phones, and the technology is getting so good that the cell phones are getting smaller and smaller. Best part about a really small cell phone, seeing somebody with a huge head use a small cell phone. Because <laughs> there's always this battle between ear and mouth, just, uh-huh, well, what I was going, okay, well, you just have to, okay, well, I'm big head! <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you know what I miss? Slamming a phone. I'm always on my cell phone. I miss, like, in the 80s, those rock-hard plastic phones. Like, if there's ever a nuclear bomb, cockroaches and those phones will be around. <laughs> I mean, I would get pissed off. Screw me! No, no, no! Screw you! Clang! Oh, that felt good. <laughs> now they know what I'm talking about. You can't do that now. Screw me! No, screw you! Fold you up there. There I go. Just <laughs> put you in my pocket. You're over warranty, so I have to be very careful. I love getting voicemails. I know within three or four seconds if I'm keeping the voicemail or getting rid of it. Like you're going to these first new voicemail message. Hi, Steve, it's your grandma. Just seven. <laughs> you're alive. Goodbye. <laughs> you know what I love? I love chapstick. I'm addicted to chapstick. I'm addicted to buying chapstick. I can't stop buying chapstick. You know why? Because I never finished one ever in my life. <laughs> Have you ever just started rubbing plastic on your lips? Oh, there we go. Two years finished. <laughs> no, I buy one. I have for three or four days. Gone. <laughs> you ever see somebody that really needs chapstick but just won't splurge the dollar fifty? You know, the lips are all brown, white, cracked, dehydrated. Anytime you yawn and start bleeding, take care of that. It's disgusting. It's 2007, you leper. <laughs> Chapstick is basically saying, nah, I'll drink water later. <laughs> How can you be too lazy to drink water? 